Hi everybody, so I just uh, saw this sign that my wife had made uh, not too long ago and uh, I thought I'd point something out uh, because there's a lot of question about um, what liquid chalk will um, stick to and not be easy to erase from uh, versus other things and here she made a sign here as you can see and it's on, I, w I wish there was a way for you to see this, it's probably going to be impossible but this is a, it's basically a piece of, um, yeah, it's kind of a, kind of piece of cardboard or something. And, uh, not cardboard rather, but like a pressed, kind of pressed wood kind of material. Um, I don't know what, maybe this is called MDF or something like that. I, I'm not, I don't remember. I don't know my, my, uh, materials that well. But if you put your thumb on it or finger on it and rub it a little bit, it feels kind of papery, you know? And which means it's probably porous, and porous, of course, means it has little tiny holes. And what happens is the liquid in liquid chalk, this is for any brand, uh, any brand of liquid chalk at all, because it's liquid, will soak down kind of, it gets kind of soaked in a little bit like a sponge, if you will, and um, just a really fine sponge. And then when you go to wipe it off, I'm not going to do that here because I don't want to ruin her sign, but um, it will some of it will come off, the surface uh, will come off with water, but it will leave a, a mark which uh, is called ghosting and it, it looks you know about maybe a fifth of the darkness of this part of the sign here is a little bit lighter here um, and um, depending on the material sometimes you can use a stuff called uh, it's a, um, a kind of a slightly abrasive spongy kind of thing called um, uh, it's from Mr. Clean. It's called Magic Eraser, and uh, but I wouldn't even use that on here because I can literally feel that it's it, it's you know probably soaked this stuff up, and so I wouldn't even bother because it's because it's abrasive. It would take off probably some of the coloring too. So I just wanted to talk about that a little bit. There's a, a fair amount of confusion about this, and um, the truth is, uh, if even uh, chalkboard is sometimes some chalkboard paint is porous and it, so it has these little tiny holes and the only way you can know for sure is just to test it a little bit and um, yeah, I would have some of that magic eraser on hand you can get it for five dollars at any uh, decent store like a Publix or Albertsons or anything like that uh, CVS Walgreens and um, five bucks for two of those little sponges and have that on hand because uh, if you do get it get liquid chalk on a porous um, or even slightly porous surface you can use it with a little bit of scrubbing and some water to to get the the ghosting off okay i hope that helps we'll do more of these kind of videos as i see materials that um, might be worth talking about